Hey guys, it's Tia. Welcome to the video. Hope you're doing well. Today I want to talk about Tea Public, which is a smaller print on demand company that's owned by Redbubble and my experience with it and how you could potentially make some sales with it, as well as why it's kind of a dodgy company, to be honest, in terms of uh, their website and the strategy, but I'll get into that later. So as you can see, I've made a couple of sales with Tee Public. Not that many, but I haven't made that many uploads anyway. So the sales that I've gotten, it's not too bad. So as I said, Tee Public is owned by Redbubble. Um, and what sells on Redbubble basically sells on Tee Public as well, just on a smaller scale. I really haven't uploaded that much on Tee Public, as I said, around 23 or so uploads now, and uh, made a few sales. So it's not too bad. So this is the kind of stuff that sells on Tee Public, and when you're uploading you have the title and various other products, not as many as Tee Public, but you've got hoodies, shirts, kids products, mugs, masks, um, and other things as well. You've got stickers as well. But the main thing with Tee Public is that the tags matter less and the description matters more. So this person clearly hasn't maximized their reach with the description it could be better but you know they still ended up on the front page so i guess they're doing pretty well um but for the rest of us we've got to work on the description a lot more and if you do that then you really should be looking at decent sales if you can make sales on redbubble basically you can make sales on t public so that's just a quick whiz stop tour of Tee Public and the strategy that I use. Basically upload similar stuff to stuff you upload on Redbubble. If you're not using Redbubble already, then I have a video, I'll link it up there on how to get sales on Redbubble. Basically apply the same concept to Tee Public and you should be looking at decent sales. I would definitely recommend trying out Redbubble or another website before you try out Tee Public because there are certain things that I'm not really a fan of which I'll get into now. So what I really wanted to talk about for this video is their search engines. So are you being found on Tee Public? And that is a question that has bothered me for a long time. So I sent an email to Tee Public last year and basically what I was saying is that I couldn't find my designs in the search. I was searching those specific keywords that I was putting in my titles and descriptions. It had already been some time, so it did have so I did give the search engine time to register them, but I still wasn't finding my designs on any of the pages. So I emailed them. I asked, why are my designs not showing up? And this is how they replied. Hi, first off, thank you for uploading to TeePublic. Appreciate how much work goes into design. Thank you. While TeePublic is an open platform where anyone can host and sell from their own storefront, our site's discovery tools more curated due to legal or creative reasons, your designs will not show up in search or on the new browse areas of the site. However, you still be able to sell with us sell your work through the direct link to your page or the individual product pages thank you for signing up with us sorry for any inconvenience Ch cheers t public community team okay so they're basically saying here that your designs aren't going to show up well that's what i thought um and i already uploaded like 20 things on there um at the time i got this email so i was like okay fine it's a lost cause um there's really no point in putting any more effort into this website so i just stopped uploading but then lo and behold congrats you've made a sale um and i think this was like a few months after i stopped uploading as well um so i made a sale last year and i was like okay i mean if nobody's finding them if they they've just told me that nobody's actually going to be finding my designs, right? Because your designs will not show up on search. But then I made another sale and then another one and another one. So are my designs unsearchable? I don't know. I guess people are finding them somehow. When I search for them now, I can't find them. So I don't know how other people are, but somehow I guess they're just getting out there. And this is what I kind of don't like about Tee Public. Like, on Redbubble, you definitely can search for your designs. You can see, you know, if I tag my design with the keyword, then it's gonna show up in the search engine. Whereas with TeePublic, I can't even find my own designs and it's just sort of a random guessing game really. But that being said, 
if you get this email or if you can't find your designs on TeePublic, it doesn't mean you should give up because as you've seen in my case, I have made sales and I've literally got an email saying that people will not be able to find your designs. So maybe give it a try, upload a few things and if it doesn't end up making you sales, then just stop. Um, but if it does, then good for you. So that's all I wanted to say about TeePublic. I'm not really planning to put much more time and energy into this website, but it's something that you might want to have a go at. Obviously, the more platforms you upload to, the more organic exposure your designs get and the more money you get. So it's up to you, really. Um, you've seen how they can be kind of strange, but at the end of the day, I would say if you have some extra time, then it's not too much of a bad idea. I mean, they do get decent exposure. They are uh, a company that recently got bought by Redbubble, so a uh, similar kind of thing, you know, they do appear on Google and they do uh, track their customers with a pixel, those uh, cookie trackers, so similar kind of thing to Redbubble, but just a bit dodgy in terms of finding your designs, that's the only problem, that's the only issue I have with it, so yeah, that's all I have to say on T Public. Thanks so much for watching, if you found this video helpful, then leave a like, subscribe and Turn on the notifications bell if you want to see more of my videos. TikTok, Instagram and Twitter in the description below and I will see you in the next video.